Hey beautiful, welcome or welcome back. If you are new here, I'm so glad you're here. My name is Jeannie. I hope by the end of the video, you'll decide to stick around for a while and possibly become part of this beauty YouTube family. I would absolutely love to have you. You can do that by hitting the subscribe button right down below. It is the red button that says subscribe. It is 100% free. And while you're down there, don't forget the notification bell. It, then YouTube will let you know every time I upload a brand new video. So, you guys, we are going to unbox my BoxyCharm base box for the month of August. This is the box that I pay for. I've already uploaded my PR box. If you missed that and you want to check it out, I'll have it linked in the description box below. This is a completely different variation. Well, I wouldn't say completely, but it's a different variation. It has a different item for the choice product. Um, and if you don't know what I mean by choice product, within BoxyCharm, there are three tiers. There's a base box, there's a premium box, and there is a quarterly luxe box box upgrade. So within the base box, you're able to customize one of your items. So that would be your choice item. The choice item that I got in my PR box that is gifted to me by BoxyCharm for review is different than the choice item that I chose for my paid for box. So that's always fun. That typically means you'll get somewhat of a different variation, which is always cool. Whenever I get duplicates, I just use them here on the channel for giveaways for you all. Now, this box costs $27.99, so about $28. Uh, you get to customize one product and you get five full-size products. I do also purchase the premium. That is also on the way. It's not here yet, but as soon as it gets here, I'll be back to unbox that as well. Every single month with BoxyCharm, we do get a theme card. The theme for August is dusk till dawn. I actually think it's very cute. I'm trying to hide the two nails that popped off earlier. <laughs> you guys are going to see them. So it is what it is. We're missing two nails and I haven't had time to fix it. So it is what it is. But on the flip side of the card, we also have all of the products in our variation along with their retail value of each product and a little bit of information about each one as well. So for the choice item that I chose for this box, it is Glow Recipe, and it is their Avocado Melt Retinol Eye Cream. It retails for $42, so right there, I you know, this paid for the box and then some. Um, and I do really love Glow Recipe products. I really love the watermelon niacinamide glow drops. I also really love their papaya enzyme melting cleanser, like cleanser balm type of thing. I literally use that pretty much on a daily basis. Um, I have fallen in love with their Plum Plump Hyaluronic Serum that has become my go-to daytime serum. So I'm really excited to give this product a try. Now, after I chose it for my box, I did hear from some different people reviewing it that it can be drying to the under eye, which I really hope I don't find is the case for me. Super cute packaging. They all, all of their packaging is just super cute. So I don't mind keeping them on display, you know, in my bathroom or wherever because the packaging is just so cute. Um, I don't know when I'm actually going to give this a try, so I'm not going to crack it yet. I really want to smell it really bad, but I'm just not going to because there is a clock that starts once you open your skincare, you know, before it goes bad, and I'm not, not quite ready to use it. I've got a lot of eye products open at the moment, so I'm going to just hold on to it, but I really do hope that I don't find it drying to the under eye. I'm already somebody who has a dry skin type. Like I'm not combination, I'm not oily, I'm dry. There are products that I have been using more recently that have really helped my dry skin, but I'm still a dry skinned girl. That's still my skin type. So I don't need anything that's going to dry me out, but I have not found that to be the case for, sorry, my phone was telling me that I had 20% battery left, so I better hurry this up. I had to like turn it off so I could see what was going on. But anyhow, yeah, I'm hoping that it's not going to be a drying product. 
Now, and next, I did get the Ollie Oop Stack the Odds. <laughs> this is a cream bronzer or contour, whatever you want to use it for, um, a cream blush and a cream highlight. It's in the shade Sunkissed. I do own this. Um, so, yeah, I, I do have this product. Now, BoxyCharm actually did send me an email saying that I was going to be receiving a product in my box that I already had. And that is because I chose this product for last month. Um, I do really like the product. As you can see, it is used. I have used it uh, several times. Now, I have a lot of products in my collection, so have I used this every day? No. But I've used it on multiple times and I have enjoyed the quality of it every time I've used it. So now I have one that I'm not gonna open because it's gonna stay and go into a giveaway here on the channel because I don't need two of them. I actually have the product in two different shades. I have Sassy Pants and Sunkissed. Sassy Pants has the more pink blush and then Sunkissed is just just a touch deeper tone like more of like a rose tone instead of like a pink tone but anyhow both of them are nice I do like the quality and I think the packaging is super cute and I like that you get you know three cream products in one that would make it really nice for travel that kind of thing so I do like that and then I'm glad to have one that I can give to one of you who maybe don't have the product to give it a try by the way, that product retails for $38, so not a cheap product. Next, from Girlactic, this is the Metallic, Metallic Eye Sparkle. Um, I did get this product in my PR box as well. It is a very, very pretty golden tone, liquid metallic eyeshadow. The shade of this is Glam. So again, I'm going to hold on to this and use it for a giveaway here on the channel. But um, I actually did use the one that I got in my PR box and I think that it's really nice. Um, as a brand, as a whole, Girlactic, I think the things that I've tried, I have really, really enjoyed. I always talk about the Rose Petal Lip Gloss love love bought like six of them in the boxy charm sale after i tried the first one so um i think this is one of the better liquid metallic shadows now liquid shadows have issues of their own across the board but i think that this is a decent one so anyhow that's gonna again go into a giveaway here on the channel because i have it i don't need to have two of them now next I got the Cab Cosmetics Loose Setting Powder. This is in Translucent. It retails for $30. It says that the setting powder mattifies, locks in makeup, minimizes oil, all in one soft, silky formula. This weightless powder will be a staple in your beauty routine keeping your shine free, keeping you shine free for six hours. And again, it retails for $60. I'm trying to get it open to look at the inner packaging. I can't get it open and I don't want to rip the box because I am dry skinned. I'm ultra picky about my setting powders. I have my few that do happen to work if I'm using a very small amount because I'm dry skinned and I'm also maturing skin. I'm 37. So um, I think I'm gonna also add this into a giveaway here on the channel because I just feel like I would probably try it once or twice. I don't need to keep any shine down. I'm trying to add shine, if that makes sense. So when it comes to a setting powder, I'm looking for something that might say blurring or um, like specifically like the By Terry Hydro Hydra setting powder with hyaluronic acid to lock in moisture. I need every bit of moisture that I can get with my dry skin. So this does not, this is not marketed as one of those types of 
powders, so I don't want to waste it. I would rather just add it into a giveaway for one of you all who maybe is on the oilier side, maybe you need something to mattify, because it's just going to get opened and wasted over here. So we're going to pass it on. Last but not least, from the brand Tannis, that is some very pretty outer packaging. It's got like a duo shift to it, very iridescent looking. This is their Sun Sunset to the Stars Lip Oil. It retails for $27. It says it's an ultra shiny gloss infused with nourishing coconut oil and pomegranate seed oil to plump and hydrate, plus a sheer shimmery pink tint that you can build with each stroke. Wow. I can never have enough lip oils. Lip oils are something that I love and adore. That actually looks quite pigmented for a lip oil. I'm actually surprised. I had not pulled this out of the packaging, so I'm a little surprised. Let me show you up close the shade. So there's definitely like a golden shift to this. Let's go ahead. I do have a full lip on. In fact, I just just filmed a whole video of trying new makeup, including the e.l.f. Halo Glow, Nomad Cosmetics eyeshadow palette, and a bunch of other things. I actually filmed this, but this video will actually go up before that video. If you're interested, though, definitely keep your eye open. But I have a full lip on because I just filmed a video. But we'll go ahead and swatch this because I am ultra curious. Wow, that is like a duochrome lip. I don't know if you guys can see that through the camera, but in real life, there is such a golden shift to that. It's actually very pretty. I just wonder how the golden tone in it is going to make my teeth look. Like, is it going to make my teeth look yellow? I sure hope not. The formula on it actually feels very smooth. I love the shine and I love the shift. Like, that is stunning. Definitely can smell a, the slightest hint of coconut in there, but definitely nothing overpowering. Again, there's that. So, yeah. To recap, we got the Glow Recipe Avocado Melt Retinol Eye Cream. We got the Galactic liquid metallic shadow we got the alley-oop stack the odds three in one cream bronzer slash contour blush and highlight we got the cap cosmetics translucent loose mattifying setting powder and we got the tannis sunset to the stars lip oil so what do i think about this box i think that this is first of all I love to try anything from Glow Recipe, so I'm happy about that. I actually do think that this is a really nice product to receive. It's just I already have it, so of course that's kind of a bummer. But again, they did give me a $6 credit, and you better believe your girl used it. I went shopping on the Mega Drop Shop. I will be back to unbox all of my purchases here with you if you're interested in seeing that just as soon as they come. But then again, a mattifying setting powder, controlling shine, all of that, that's not what I need. So not really thrilled with that product. I do think that this is a cool product to receive and try, but I got it my PR box, so I don't need another one. The lip oil, I am pretty excited to give a try to. So all in all, I think this box was okay. Definitely not my favorite BoxyCharm base box that I have ever received, but some of that is just due to me receiving the products in prior boxes. And part of that has to do with me being on BoxyCharm's PR list. So you're going to get duplicates, you know, if you're on the PR list and you still purchase your own boxes. I get the base box and the luxe box in PR. I do not receive a premium PR box, just the base box every month. And then on the Lux months, I do receive that Lux quarterly upgraded Lux box in PR as well. For what I purchase, I also purchase the base box and then I purchase the premium box. So um, I'm going to end up with duplicate products. That's just, it's going to happen. So you can't be mad at BoxyCharm. That's not at 
at a fault of their own. It's just going to happen. And then again, honestly, I really don't mind it because it, it, gives me an opportunity to add to my giveaways that I have here on the channel for you all because I love to do giveaways here as well. Um, actually, I have a giveaway going on right now. It is for the Manny MUA Lunar Beauty Nude Prism Eyeshadow Palette. If you have not gotten your entry for that giveaway and you didn't know about the giveaway, I have it linked in the description box below. You can get your entry there and that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you so much for taking the time to hang out with me for a while and I will see you so very soon in my next video. Bye.